Be thankful for what you have. Be glad you are dry and warm, as there are many in this world without shelter from the storm. Never underestimate nature's power. Embrace the beauty, fear the wrath. Be intrepid through your life's journey. Never crossing the tempest's path. There's a wonderment to high contrast. It's a mystery why there's wet and dry. Perhaps because extreme bring our awareness to the dark of the moon versus the sunlit sky. In detaching ourselves emotionally from storms passing through life freely, we can look beyond the danger of one to see its reason and its beauty. In applying this concept to our lives, whereby we go forward with acceptance, we are able to overcome adversity by flowing with the joys of least resistance. Be thankful for what you have. Be glad you are dry and warm, as there are many in this world without shelter from the storm. March's full worm moon reaches peak illumination at 2.50 p.m. Eastern Standard Daylight Time. Today, Sunday, March 28, 2021. It is the first full moon to occur after the spring equinox on March 20th. March's full moon is the Paschal full moon. It determines the date of Easter and my 60th birthday on April 4th, 2021. And here is what 60 years of life has taught me. Just about one important lesson per decade. Like who you are, want what you have, be glad for love when it comes to you, Accept where you are stationed in life. Embrace how life changes like the moon. And only sometimes you dare to ask why. My woodland home was built into a knoll on the side of a mountain 60 years ago. This video was taken by me from inside my dining room windows this morning during the rising of the full moon storm of March 28, 2021. A day, a season, and a time for gratitude, just like all the other times. Uh-oh, it's hail. It's hailing. Oh, boy.